All right. Hey there, everybody. Hope you're doing well. We are, uh... Where the heck are we? We should be going into a battle. Oh, you know what? That's right. Decided not to take that battle. So, we're not going into battle right now. But, uh... We are chugging our way into Winter Quarters. Strategy... Yeah, we've actually fallen behind. Despite having more men... It seems like the AI is particularly bad. In our battles. I, I mean, some of the tactical stuff is just... It's incredible, but... It's not my responsibility for once, so... We'll blame someone else. But the Union has done some... I I don't know if they're good things or not. Right? They have... Alright, so now they're down to one pocket. They had three pockets down here earlier. And I think they're just going to get collapsed on. Maybe that's what's happening right now. And then, and then wiped, so... We'll see, but... uh. We are still tagging along with Beauregard. Wherever there he is. That's right. We lost that auto resolve. It's all it's all coming back to me now. And uh, it says they're eager. I don't know if any of that's true. I think maybe this Sheffield. See, that's a nothing cav regiment. But I probably keep him from getting killed. Then I got to give up brigade command. Our brigade's actually decent. Uh, I think chat. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, that's right. We, we, we've already been through this. I think it's the only one I can go for. I don't have enough prestige for any of the others. Uh, it's 405. I don't know, though. It's pretty much just a... <laughs> it's actually not that different than what I'm doing right now. So it's just I have a very small coverage that I can go out and scout with and probably get it killed and a uh, bunch of other stuff I don't want to have happen. So maybe I'll, I'll sit tight until it's better. Actually, I wonder how much how much did it cost for some of those proper... So 1.1, 1.1. All right. Well, that's good to know. I don't think there's anything special in here that's going to help me this little known in Hermit Commander of the 5th Brigade Beauregard's Corps, Lomax's army. That is an accurate description of me. Thing is, the stats actually aren't trash. Order our units to march northwest. It sounds like a battle is brewing. <laughs> it's damn cold. Winter season. Let's see if this follows through and ends up being a battle. I don't know what we're going to get here. I don't know, man. I don't... It looks like whatever we got is way more than what they have. Alright, so this is... Chapter 2, that's fine. Uh, yeah, it's probably true at this point. <laughs> we arrived in the nick of time for who knows what. Is it me after one of my food poisonings? Yeah, so if you missed it, <laughs> if you missed episode 3, uh, Apparently the spouse that attends uh, camp with you has uh, food poisoned me twice over the summer of 62 in an attempt to get me to go home. Alright, so we're losing Wheeling, but we took Cumberland. And from the perspective of holding West Virginia, it's probably not a great trade. It's really odd what the AI is doing, only because it, for the Confederacy, they're really set to defensive. Uh, and to rarely consider offensive stuff. So I don't know if it, I don't know if it's overriding that because I'm on that side, uh, and both sides, everybody is set to kind of not do stuff during winter quarters. So I'm, I'm surprised. Disaster at Jasper. About three days in Confederate Duncan's cavalry, twenty-two thousand, and the Federal Army with twenty-five thousand. Wow, and they lost. That's embarrassing. Just 
Still doing major general prices prices. Who is it now? Leonidas Polk. Alright, so he's out of the sin bin. Been there. Well, if it's winter quarters, is this us rebuilding or establishing? Ironworks being constructed, repaired. I don't know if that's ours or who's. I'm not even sure it matters. Uh, if it's going to be this, though, over winter quarters, I don't know if I'll keep you in. Apparently, it's active another. Dude, I am in the wrong theater. Yeah, I really am in the wrong theater. Oh, but now I'm in a battle. Uh, so, we're going to be, holy moly. It's interesting to see the AI do this. Yeah, I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll go fight it, because we could definitely, if you've seen Beauregard before, but apparently Winfield Scott. I thought last time we saw him, he had two or three stars, and now he's up to five, and Beauregard had five, and now he's four. Yeah, it doesn't, doesn't matter. We're going to go in there, and we're going to do our brigade's worth. All right. So I guess even though we're supposed to come in late, we're actually not. And it's a meeting engagement on uh, the Pine Mountain map. All right. We'll see what comes our way. Mm-hmm. So we're on the left, so we're going to assume that we're going to need to stay on the left. But if it's meeting engagement, it must also be really close. We don't need this. We don't need this. Why does this matter? I actually don't know. Hmm. Oh, well. Alright, so we took it. Oh, I didn't know there was a stone. How did I miss that? On wow. No excuse for missing that on the map. Um, here, maybe we'll uh, move over here. I don't know. I don't see anybody over there yet. But we see some union coming through this way. Looks like we're going to have more. Rather than sit as a reserve, we're going to have them come over here and we're going to have a small force, I guess, up at the top of Pine Mountain. I think we should move here. Man, it has been rough, though, trying to get... This brigade does not replenish like uh, they do in Gamer, or there's something up with the... Morale of the brigade or the the home state. Well, they need the encouragement of a good commander. Unfortunately, <laughs> that's not who they have. All right, we'll see if the union does anything. End of day. Well, we'll see how the AI handles this. Don't love that. But hey, there they are. I guess we hit play and then have to run back. Maybe? I think there's a little bit of high... Yeah, there is. So we'll at least try to get on this high ground here and see what we can do. Still has a set minor defeat. Huh. Boy to engage. All right. Well, I guess maybe we'll uh, we'll do that over there. And I guess we didn't reach the uh, deployment zone last time either. That was odd.
guess maybe enough of our unit wasn't here? Is there a little bit of high ground here? No. Relative to some other areas there is, but... Let's see if we have the uh, grand perspective. So, I mean, we're, we're leaving him with all of this. I hope we have a force that screens on the right there. It'd be nice if we actually were able to use more of that stone wall. Not sure. Must be the skirm. All right, so it's skirmishes out here. But as I found on the Winchester map a couple of videos ago, can't really ignore what the brigade's doing. That's how accidents happen. Since we are a bit small, but I think we have a decent ability to read the battlefield, we'll keep ourselves in reserve and flex to where we need to be. Yep. Hmm. It is kind of cool to watch from here. I'm not going to bother spending prestige since I'm a couple hundred prestige away from actually getting an, an actual real division with decent brigades. I don't feel like... I don't even know what it would cost. Sixty-eight prestige. That, that actually wouldn't be too much. You know, you'd probably, yeah, twenty-five hundred troops. You'd probably actually get the prestige back just in the casualties you deal. But I don't know. I'm not trying to. I'm not trying to min-max this. I've done enough of that with Grand Tactician. I am trying to just role-play the the advance here. What's up to our right? And that's ground we seeded. Now we're kind of just dancing back and forth here. So their cavalry is last samurai themselves into the artillery, I think. Unless no one else is watching that. Uh, yeah, this doesn't look good. These guys have gone out too far. Again, if I were taking command, <laughs> the other side split themselves. No, there's no way you're going to give us that to engage. There is no way. It can't be. I think their cab is actually pulling a kind of NTW3 move. Let's see if they pay for it. Uh, yeah. Well, except the cab got routed. All right, we should be able to handle the march, so let's go for it. I'm afraid of losing this pocket because everyone else is so far, so far over. I mean, that group should be here. So that it could, could have flexed to the center or over here. And yeah, we're gonna lose that entire division there. I think it's Bragg's division. We got other folks that are all kind of spread out and coming in. Yeah, we could easily lose this.
just don't understand, man. I wish I, I was more certain of what the some of the values are in battle preps and what it means when you, you choose them. Because uh, I'm just not sure a lot of times. But whatever it is that takes, like, you know, increases their recognition that, hey, like, this is going on, you need to get over there. I mean, these guys are just dancing through the woods here and probably get themselves fatigued. Jackson's going to go out. I mean, we're just sitting on a stone wall doing doing nothing. I mean, collecting the victory points doesn't really matter uh, that much. Yeah, particularly when you're giving up two to one casualties. And you're giving them up because it, it is odd though, right? Like the AI settings for us should be the AI, the battle AI settings for them. And yeah, they're a Okay, so they're somewhat spread. Yeah, it's pretty pretty nasty over here. It's a little bit better over here. But I mean, they, they should be reading the situation. They are outnumbered. They should not be taking this fight. They should fall back. But I, I'm worried that these guys are going to get obliterated, and then we're going to get defeated in turn. I think there's so many brigades on their side just wandering around out there. They're probably going to find something that they like. I'm thinking of leaving this zone here and Coming over here with Tappan and see what see what can be done because I think this is a little bit more defensible. There's a chance that maybe we'll catch some of those brigades apart. But yeah, they're starting to break behind us. Now they're moving troops over to that. I don't know, man. All right, get this out of here. I don't know how this brigade let them run right by them. It's a thinker. Alright, but we'll see if there's an opportunity here. We'll push up here. going horrendously bad. I mean, they got a great concave there. And, uh... Yeah, we need to skedaddle on out of here. I don't even think we really want to engage this. Early's going to get crushed. His undersized brigade ain't going to be able to do it. So, we need to get moving. gonna lose so many brigades over here. And I don't even know if we're gonna get those. We've lost another one here. I mean I would assume that the brigades would be of somewhat equal quality. It doesn't feel that The army is not the brigade.
Skirmishers proceed this. Pick on them. I think that's early running. I'm guessing that's not going well. Beauregard's just gone AWOL. He hasn't, I don't know if he's giving orders to the rest of the army or what. doesn't even look like this has gone well. It looks like we've kind of fed brigades in piecemeal, so. Wow, but it is, I don't know if this is right, man. I mean, holy moly, being down 5,000. And I don't know, like, other brigades and stuff are, are moving. It's just a lot of these are kind of just sitting there. Very odd. This isn't really a place we want to be. Maybe the range on these is just less than I thought. Yeah, I really wish we had those Mississippis. Huh. Alright, so that's what I was a little concerned about. Let's get out of here. Bring our skirmishers with us. guys might want to pay attention to what's going on around them. Maybe they don't. But I would. But 
Yeah, I mean, even this artillery hasn't... Oh, okay, they did find it. Yeah, it's just a sea of blue over there. Yeah, I don't know what Sems is doing. He's going to get wrecked if he doesn't get out of there. for now. See if we can get on their flank and force them back. Not sure. But if all these reserves or whatever they are, they're just going to sit back, we're going to get wrecked brigade by brigade. up and try to save their flank, I think both those brigades are going to hit mine, and they both look bigger than I am. You know, you can almost make use of that stone wall, though. My guess is it's gonna be atrocious casualties. Yo. But I mean, what is this force waiting for? I mean, just come on in. I mean, you could come in if you sent them running killed capture, you could probably bring this close to even on casualties.
others are moving up too. They bunched up a little bit, but actually that's that happens to be okay. was our chance to get flanking fire on them. And now, and now we're not gonna get it. Now we're just gonna have to fight them straight up. I don't wanna go straight up against two brigades. We're already undersized. It was nice when they moved up together. It was a little sad when they stopped moving up together. Not as good, but hey, if our understrength brigade takes two brigades out of the fight, that's not bad. The fight still rages over here. We haven't collapsed, but it don't look like we have that much. Well, one, two, three, four, five. Five brigades are ready. These guys are pretty much out of it. Over here, we've, looks like we've been pushed back. Pretty much everything has buckled. Two brigades here. Looks like Shank over overplayed his hand. He might get crushed, but I'm not sure. Even if they rally, we'll be 50-50 there. <laughs> it's so silly. Uh, yeah, these forces here are desperately needed to come up on the left. Support the center. Don't stand. I got 90 degree angles to them. I, I don't know what else to tell you. All right, we'll send another round of skirmishers back out. And I'll try once again to come up on their flank. See what we get. Experiencing the blob it certainly looks like it. Dude, this is rough, man. So we had twenty-five thousand, so being down six or seven thousand casualties means we actually have a numbers advantage. I just don't know if it's going to mix with everything else and be all right. How tired. They're not. Not really. It should have been 
harder to hit. Oh no, they're not they're not gonna lay down. such a big difference these guys could uh, a bunch of them broke but they're at least condensing or consolidating around looks like bucks they're in seniors position over here I forget who this is but even if he deals with Schley he looks like he's taking himself so far to position he's gonna be a non-factor
no surprise the burritos left out. Part by me. Now we're moving at least one other brigade up, but it doesn't really seem to be making a difference. I mean, all four of theirs are solid. They don't look like they're about to crack. I think this is just going to end up being a ridiculously brutal battle. their job. They harassed them on their left enough that they had to call them back. Hmm? Oh man, alright, I thought we were going to get a rest, we're not. So we're going to send skirmishers up on their flank, and then we're going to march the brigade around. Let's see how that works. Yeah, that's pretty much right. And then just march these folks down. But actually, I could probably march them right here help them shoot up that brigade. Kind of the same process we've already seen. Now my guys when they're supposed to lay down long, so I don't know exactly what to do it, but we just took 40 casualties in a short amount of time. Yeah, maybe it makes sense to just put in the default weapons, engage it. Well, yeah. I 
I don't know about that one, man. I mean, it's... Eh, you know, moral might break. I mean, maybe this is just kind of where my brigade comes to an end. Eh, I was looking for a division anyways, so whatever. Division command, so maybe we just have to do that after this. We'll lay down, try to limit some of the casualties, but that's just atrocious stuff. That might be one change I make. I, I'm not sure uh, adding the, the default weapons back in just because. I don't know if it's going to lead them to take more Gatling guns and other things, but if I don't have my personalities in there, the AI personalities, or all the weapons mods, I'm not sure it's going to hold up. Hmm. That? Okay. I thought they routed. They didn't route. That's good to know. Uh, oh, that is unfortunate. We have two more brigades coming up. Really unfortunate. They're falling back. They're bringing more numbers in. I would have loved to inflict more casualties with you. I would. But I I don't know, man. I don't think this Oh, okay, so they did actually take so it just jumped from ten to twenty thousand. Alright, well that's not as bad, but I don't know, so it's weird, like, when I, I send skirmishers up and I come on their flanks, they, they know to refuse it, but these guys are just, our guys are just standing there, while they go ahead and plop themselves down on the flank. Check on the right. Yeah, these guys have done absolutely nothing either. But yeah, they're breaking, or they've broken. We got a couple of brigades there, but... They look like they're just being shoveled in piecemeal. Yeah, I was not expecting this to be a one battle video. Playing against seems to understand the concept of a line pretty well. I mean, these guys are just acting like they, they can't even see them. I don't know what that is. Probably not my job, but I guess I'm going to have to come back here and try to protect the left as well as the right. The enemy is retreating. Well then. Uh, 
And I, I guess we don't need to worry about them routing. But that doesn't look like a retreat. Well, we didn't preserve the brigade that well. <laughs> we did something, but it wasn't that. Those skirms are getting some casualties inflicted at the end. Just uh, run it out at this point. Oh, good. I I'm glad he tells me that now because I feel like I was already here. But thank you, companion. Thank you. Try to get our skirmishers back. Ow. I don't know where that came from. Who are these guys? Oh. They're just dudes standing there. Alright. There we go, now the dude's running away. That's that's better. Alright, and finally, that one will be over. I wanna see the newspaper report. 161 prestige. That that's uh that might be enough to get me a division. Then I have some control over this nonsense. Colonel Maney has fallen in disgrace. All right, what was it? Uh, so. 2,700 killed of them, 3,000, so we took 400 more killed, 4,000 of them captured, so it's six, 7,000 out, and for us it should be less than that, 9,500 rifles, yeah, so I guess in the bigger picture we uh, probably did out casualty them, but not by the ratio that historically they would have helped them. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Well, the aftermath of that will be something since we're in enemy territory and, uh, yeah, we're probably, are we out of supply? 
Uh, I can't tell if that's us. It, it probably is, but that'll be something. Anyways, it'll be something we'll have to deal with in another episode. We'll have to figure out how we're going to get back to home territory intact. Shop around for a division command that's not an entirely beat up and depleted division. Let's see what we can do with that. And uh, then wait and see how the next battle is going to go and how... <coughs> excuse me, this war is going to go. I'm not... I'm not really sure. 